hello everyone welcome back to the map of mathematics in this video we are going to solve this nice radical or square root problem and uh, now we have m plus 7 square root is equal to 5 minus m square root and we will solve this problem for the value of m uh, okay so uh, the very first thing we are going to do is here first we will remove this a square root sign on both of the sides uh, so that in order to remove this square root sign we just uh, take the square on both of the sides uh, so that we have m plus 7 square root and its whole square is equal to 5 minus square root of m whole square okay here uh, i will just take the square on both of the sides so we will get the remaining terms in this form so in the if you can focus in the left hand side and here you can see that the square and square root are undo each other and here we obtain m plus 7 is equal to here you have m minus square root of m and here i will apply uh, the famous uh, uh, identity and you know that if we have a minus b whole square so it is equals to a square plus 2ab plus b square okay so in the right hand side we will apply this famous identity so here you get uh, you have a is 5 and the value of b is square root of m you just substitute this values of a and b in this formula so that we will obtain here uh, 5 square plus 2 times of a b and the value of a is 5 and the value of b is square root of m plus b square and the value of b is square root of m so uh, this will become square root of m and whole square so now we can simplify both of the sides so in the left hand side we have m plus 7 is equals to here you have 5 square it is equal to 25 plus this two fives are 10 times of square root of m and plus this uh, two and square root are undo each other and here you got uh, plus m and now we can take uh, okay here you remember one thing which is uh, it is the formula of a minus b whole square so in a minus b whole square this sign is negative a square minus 2 a b plus b square and similarly here you have this sign is negative okay so that uh, this is also negative and now we can take um, the uh, this uh, this term and uh, this these two terms in the left hand side so that it will become m plus 7 it is minus 10 times of square root of m and when we can take this uh, to the left hand side it will become plus 10 times of square root of m and this is plus m and in the left hand side we have minus m is equal to 25 so that this minus m and plus m are gone and here you have plus 7 now we can take this plus 7 to the right hand side and it will become 10 times of square root of m is equal to 25 minus 7 so that uh, here you got 10 times of square root of m is equal to 25 minus 7 is equals to 18 and now we can uh, take this 10 to the right hand side so that we get square root of 5 is equal to 18 over 10 and now we will remove this square root uh, because here we just find the value of m so that uh, here we again take the square on both of the sides so that we uh, get the term in this form square root of m square over 
18 over 10 square this two and square root are undo each other and in the left hand side we have m is equals to and in the right hand side we will just canceling these two terms and here you can see that two nines are 18 and two fives are 10 so here you get 9 over 5 whole square and the 9 square is equal to 81 and 5 square is equal to 25. So this is the our final value of m and this is our final answer. So thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel for more exciting videos.